yes to your plan for his life. Yes, with his time, his energy, and his abilities. He is saying, I feel called. I'm prepared to do what God's called me to do. I will do the work of the ministry. So, Brother Joseph, we lay hands on you and we license you as a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ. And we ask that God's power and anointing will be upon you. May you go from this place knowing his anointing and his blessing for we ask this in Jesus name Amen and stretch your hands this way would you church please stretch it towards the brother Father I just thank you right now in the name of Jesus Lord that the work that you started him you will finish you will perfect it Father I thank you Lord that you'll bring him to that place that, of the fullness that you've called him to be Lord and I thank you Father in the name of Jesus no weapon fashioned against him will prosper Father. neither height nor depth nor principle power or powers will stop this what's going on father mm. that this love of Christ in him will flourish and I thank you father that his blessing that your blessing is upon him in the name of Jesus amen I thank you, Father, for the brother Joe. And I ask, Lord, that you would continue to do the work in him. I thank you, Lord, as you direct him in the days ahead, Lord, that you know with confidence you're leading. And I thank you, Lord, that his hands are anointed to do the work that you have for him to do. I thank you, we believe that signs and wonders will fall in, in the ministry. In Jesus' name, we thank you. Amen. We have a certificate of you. Do you guys remember when you were going through this, how humbling it was, and how wonderful it was? I, I, right away, I think of Murray Ford. He used to say, it's green right now, you need to hang it on your wall until it turns brown. Uh, 